The scene is now set for uh, the man who works miracles with his dogs. He runs the uh, famous Kipperidge uh, dung, gun dog team. And it is uh, great to welcome Adrian and Caroline Slater. Thank you. We're going to be quick today. I'm always in trouble for being too long. So we've cut the pups out. Most important thing with gun dog training, what is it, guys? Steadiness to the retrieve. So we've got George now where he's steady. You take his lead off, darling. We're just going to walk him up to the jump. So just give us a few dummies. So what is steadiness with a Labrador? Well, basically, it means the dog will sit and wait while we throw something and he retrieves on command. I with a command back or his name, whichever. So just walk him up and uh, what we'll do, we'll let him have a little warm up. So, how do we get the dog steady? We get him steady by using memory retrieves. So that's where we show Caroline one, or show George one, and we turn him off Caroline, walk him away, and then we, we turn him back, and we're ready to send. So basically, you're making the dog use his mind as a memory retrieve. A bit like fly ball, if you think about it. That's what fly ball is, isn't it? Memory retrieve down the road. Right, Caroline, when you're ready, let's warm him up. Brilliant. Will he go back? He better add. Yes. Good start, guys. So we're going to raise, shall we raise the bar? So, George has been jumping that high. We thought we'd invest in some show jumping jumps. Yeah, so these are actually for horses. So once your dog starts doing memory retrieves, we want him to go back several times. So what you'd do is you'd have two or three retrieves out. Obviously, while we're on carpet, we're going to do one at a time. So Caroline's now ready for teaching memory retrieves. But of course, we're putting in a show on. So I want you guys to take part as well. So when the, when the Olympics was on and there was jumping, they wound them up with a, 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 an applause. So they started doing that. So we could do that, guys. And then what we'll do, we'll have George jumping high. So speed your clap up as you go, when you're ready. Go on. That's brilliant. Excellent. Thank you. Better audience than last year. Right. So we're going to put another dummy out. Obviously, George doesn't know nothing about it. So he's got to trust us. Shall we raise the bar? Yes. So we are now getting somewhere similar. Now, of course, what's special about Crufts, guys? Yeah, we did a demonstration last year. We're going out in the arena. I'm quite pleased with myself. Everything seemed to go OK. And of course, a young boy said, I thought he's going to say, Luke, there's Adrian Slater. What did he say? Luke, there's George. Wasn't bothered about me. Right, guys, let's clap him on again. Faster. Right, babe. Yes. Come on, George. Yes. Right. Now, this next height we haven't done. I'll show you how we've done it. Because I want to leave it for the big night. We've done it like that. Yeah. Should we do it level? Yeah. No. Today, I like getting ideas from different things. And we went right to the top watching uh, earwork to music. And I got a few good ideas. But right at the top, it doesn't look this high down here. Now, what you've got to remember, anybody knows me, I'm six foot five. <laughs> what are you laughing at? So this is high. Right, you're going to really clap because I don't know if he can do it. Right, so come on, guys. Right, line him up. Go on, George. Yes! Come on, George. Oh! Fantastic. Right, we're going to bring them spaniels in. You'll like this bit. It's four inches higher than the jump we used to have in. Um, I thought he might do it because usually he jumps better 
coming back with the retrieve in his mouth. Right, we're going to come over here and we're going to bring the nutters out so you can see me under pressure now. Can you see them back here? Little darlings. I know you've been sat in there for an hour, so let's just uh, relax. Right, come here. So, sit. I got ideas from Flyball. So, well, don't think I'm going to be doing ear work to music, so don't worry about that. See, well, I got these ideas from Flyball, but in the gun dog world, what we'll call it is a picking up exercise. So we're going to put five balls. Last year we did this with two spaniels and it went pretty good. Everybody seemed to enjoy it. So I thought, we're on at night. Let's push the boat. Hopefully we get it right. So what we're going to do, we're going to walk down this end, leave them in a sit. That Tim is a little tinker when he comes in here. So then we're going to call them, stop them, and send them back. Flint. Flint. Bobby, your name's not Flint. Rose. That was terrible. Sick. Tim. Ready. Fred. Sit. Tim. 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 Sit. I don't believe that. Sit. When was your name Freddy? Er, uh, Flynn? The one I thought might do it wrong did it right. You better get the next bit right. Sit. Tim. Right. So we're going to see if we can control them, which it don't look like we can, does it? Yeah? So we're going to throw a ball, send them, stop them, and try and go all through the team. Hopefully it works. I did have loads of her before I started balling with these. Flint. Bobby. Rosie. Sit. We'll do it again. Tim. Fred. We did a little show a couple of weeks ago. It went perfect. Sit. Here, come here. Come on. Fred. Fred and me. Sit. Right. Sit. There's going to be a discussion here. Right. Pay attention, not you, Rosie. Rosie, Rosie. We're going to put two balls. Are you going down? In there. And two balls in here. Rose, Neil. And this is where it gets hard, and we're not even started yet. Heel. So come on, heel, Rose. Flint. Right. Let's come down this end. Bobby. Rosie. So, what we did last year, and it didn't just go perfect, we tried to send Fred one way, Tim the other way. Yeah, so that's what we're going to do today, Fred. Heel. Heel. Now you've been warm, Fred. Freddy, 
One more and you're out. Okay. Right. So we're going to send Tim in that corner and Fred in that corner. Tim. Fred. Tim. Fred. Tim. Fred. Fred. Tim. Right, you're, you're going. Fred, Tim, get out. Fred. Sit. Come here. Work your fault, Tim. Sit. We're going to have to change your sketch. Right, Fred. You're off. All right, I can't. What's your name? Freddy Slater. Right, you're off, Fred. Fred, get out. Fred. Get out. Get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. Oh! All right, come back on. Fred, get out. Tim, Tim. Fred. Tim, whistle's not working tonight, guys. Fred, get here, or you will be off. Sit. Come on, Tim, you can do it. He started so well with George. Come on, guys, give him a big round of applause. Sit. I'm just glad it's me it's gone wrong with and not Caroline. Sit. So what we're going to do now, guys, is I'm going to move across here and we're going to go into the shooting day. Everybody seems like the shooting day. Heel, heel. Tim. Sit. Heel, Tim, Rosie. Sit. Sit. Right, sit. I'm going to get, uh, oh, I've got my retrieves. Where's my gun? Oh, I don't believe it. Sit. It's not going down well, guys. Sit. Caroline, guess what? I've got a forgotten gun. It's just not going right. Do you think you could ask security to bring the gun on, please? <laughs> Something's gone right. Sit. Sit. I remember when I started doing demonstrations, they actually said to me, it doesn't matter if it goes wrong, well, it won't have to tonight. Right. Hopefully, everybody, when, I, when we go for breakfast, they all said to me, when are you going to get that gun working? Hopefully, it works tonight. Sit. Probably gun will work and nothing else. Sit. Right. We all right if I put a treat down go, won't it? I just got a treat out of my pocket. Right. We've got our uh, Louise has just come in, and this is Oscar, guys. Oscar's never been indoors before in an arena doing a demonstration. He'll probably do better than me. Uh, but Oscar, I don't know if the picture's coming up, but Oscar was a rescue dog. And uh, obviously, there we go, guys. So a friend of ours, Big Brent, we call him, he rescued him. Of course, my girls saw him and they couldn't resist. So obviously, Oscar's one of the team now. So if he gets it right, just give him a really big, big clap, guys. Right, he'll come on. Rose. Right, uh, Rosie, Rose. Rose. Hello. Law. Send Oscar when you're ready, cop. Make him sit first. Come on, Oscar, you can do it. Back over. Yes. Excellent. Brilliant. Remember what we're, what we're promoting, guys, at Crows. Happy, healthy dogs. 
Yeah, we're going to carry on a bit. Thank you. Why are you under there? That's, that's another thing what's broken. Right, Bobby, Bobby. Right, we don't want the pheasant. Where is he? I've put your name on this and so it's not going well, but we're going to give it a go. There's a rabbit, hopefully, in that far corner. Fred, get here. Sit. Fred, get out. Get out. Get out. <laughs> Calm down. Get out. Get out. Get out. No, you can not Yes! Oh! Fred, sit. Well, it's a good job he didn't do George's sketch. Right, thank you. Right, where are we up to? Because I've lost the plot. Actually, I'll be happy when it's tea time. <laughs> right, Caroline, sort that pheasant out for me, Freddy. No, not you, Fred. It's Freddy the pheasant. Right, Bobby, you're doing it again. I'm not told you, hunt on. Excellent. Brilliant, guys. Right, are we ready? <laughs> Right, hopefully we got two rabbits. And guess where they are? They're in the tunnel. So, Bobby, you come first. Bob, sit. Bob, get out. Bob. What? Oh. I'll let you off. That's not a rabbit, Bobby. Bobby, Bobby, we're not. No, Bob, 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 come here. I remember when Bobby in 2010 run off because he was frightened. Look at him now. Sit. Right. Rosie pull us out to. to... Somehow, the rabbit is in the tunnel. It's in that tunnel over there. Next year, Carolina, I will be practicing. Rosie, get out. 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 She's remembered. Come on. Yes! Thank you! Good. Yeah. You've been watching Adrian and Caroline Slater, guys. Everybody have a lovely rest of the night. Thank you. See you next year. Ladies and gentlemen, give them all a massive round of applause. Adrian and Caroline Stater, they are, they're brilliant. They are brilliant.